Welcome to the Daily Reminder Network. In an effort to revive the traditions of the last and the noblest messenger. Sunnah Revival by Sheikh Mu'iz Bukhari Sunnah of Smiling Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh My dear brothers and sisters in Islam, this is Mu'iz Bukhari recording for the Daily Reminder Network. Our deen is so beautiful. It is so beautiful that it is not considered a religion alone, but rather a complete way of life. And we are fortunate indeed to be a part of the Ummah of the best of the best, Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. He was sent as a mercy to us and our maker praises him in the Noble Quran, where he azza wa jal states, وَإِنَّكَ لَعَلَىٰ خُلُقٍ عَظِيمٍ that you, O Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, are of a great moral character. And it was from the character of Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, this noble character that he used to always maintain a pleasant demeanor and he also used to always have a smile on his face. So smiling is the sunnah that we will be touching on in this video, inshallah ta'ala. The Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, is reported to have said, and this narration is recorded in Tirmidhi, Smiling at your brother is considered an act of charity. And he sallallahu alayhi wa sallam is also reported to have said, and this particular narration is recorded in the Mustadrak of Imam al-Hakim, Do not look down upon any good deed, however small it may be, even if it be greeting your brother with a pleasant face. Jarir ibn Abdullah radiallahu anhu, a companion, he describes Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam that whenever Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam used to look at him, he sallallahu alayhi wa sallam used to smile at him. And another narration in Muslim where the Sahaba, the companions, Ridwanullah ta'ala alayhi wa jama'een, they state that after Fajr in general, we used to sit with Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam and after Fajr, after the sun has risen, we used to narrate stories and joke and laugh and the Prophet ﷺ used to smile. At times, we think that ibadah is only confined to acts of worship such as prayer, fasting and other rituals. And we think that charity can only be given by an individual who has a surplus of wealth. But the sunnah of our beloved Prophet Muhammad ﷺ begs to teach us otherwise. Just try it. Smiling is good for you. It does not cost you a million dollars. It makes you look years younger. It is contagious. I'm sure as I'm smiling right now, most of y'all are smiling back already. And even if it does not cost you a million dollars, you do need a good heart to smile. You do need a kind heart to smile. And you do need a generous heart to smile. For by smiling, you're actually giving out a piece of your good heart. You're giving out a piece of your good character to brighten someone else's day. There's no point in having a very religious appearance and being stone-faced for that is the sign of a hard heart. So let us work on our conduct as well as our appearance in terms of emulating our beloved Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. So keep smiling for it is a sunnah and please share the video around. Wa akhir da'waya and alhamdulillahi rabbil alameen. Jazakum Allah. Support the Dawah. Donate now. Go to thedailyreminder.org slash donate.